Okay. Is being a Christian just about being good? <clears throat> or the absence of bad? I'm going to say yes. Well, that's not all it's about, but it's about that. That's why some people, when uh, you say, well, I'm Christian, they all of a sudden are mad at you. <clears throat> not mad at you because of the way you look, they're mad at you because of what you represent. They know you stand for something better. That's good. Um, and in a point of reality, we're not just being good or thinking that we're being good. We're actually practicing at being better uh, or at being good. And we've made a commitment in our heart to do just that. We've committed our hearts to become something better. Christ says, pick up your cross, follow after me. And he said, if you don't, if you don't pick up your cross, you're not worthy of him. Well, the cross represents the sacrifice of doing evil, or the sacrifice of satisfying your flesh. Literally, one place it says we have become dead to sin. Apostle Paul wrote that. So, and if you're going to do that, brother, you're going to you are going to um, pardon me. If you're going to do that, then you're going to uh, have a rough time because what I found out in doing that is that my flesh wants to rise up and do its own thing. You know, my flesh still wants to do all the old things that it used to do. But I've made a commitment and a love in me keeps me going in that direction. So, is it about being good? Man, you better believe it's about being good. The Bible says, Be ye holy, even as your Father which is in heaven is holy. Holy what? Holy good. God is everything that is good. He represents everything. Uh, includes the joy that we know. Includes the blessings that we enjoy. The serenity. The peace. Uh, it, it includes it's everything. The gifts, the people that we know that are good people and that we love. God is all of that. Every good and perfect gift, the Bible says, come down from above. That means that all the good things that we know came from God. The Bible says, Psalms 24, 1, that the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. That means that everything that you see, hear, smell, feel, or touch, God owns it all. So, when we become uh, newly born, like, like Christ talked about in in uh, John 3, John chapter 3. He said that we're born again or we become something new. Apostle Paul wrote about later. Um, <clears throat> it's amazing to me how a baby can start from nothing almost seemingly and, and become a whole human person. She goes into the delivery room with one and comes out with two. Well, one inside of her, um, you know, that you, you can't see right away, but there's evidence, but you can't see it. And then she comes out with another little person. And that's the way we are as, as Christians. We start out in the same fashion, in a slow manner, and we begin to grow. And as we get older, and some people get, you know, when you get older, you get cranky and stuff like that. And some Christians are like that. You know, they get to thinking they know everything. And <clears throat> we don't know anything as we should, you know. But we're, we're just to love one another. Man. And, and let me tell you something. If you, if you just learn that one simple rule of loving one another, 
you become you don't just become something better you become something this world has never seen before um, you become something that this world is not used to being around and a, a, a light that that hurts their eyes to, to look at that's you know that's why they get upset you know, I used to do the same thing when I was a sinner oh Mr. Goody Two Shoes thinks he knows everything you know <laughs> I've been a Christian for 30 something years I uh, I see myself in a dim view in that day so yeah if you if you want to be something good you know take up Christianity God's able to and there's a lot I can sit here and talk for hours about this because see Jesus can help you be good as a matter of fact the Bible said he chastises those that he loves so he, he's going to help you to be good if you're his child the Lord will help you to know how to be good is it about being good? Yes. Thank you for joining me again. We'll see you again next time. Right here with another great subject. Cross in the Middle Ministry. Hit it, babe.